Oh, hello there. Welcome back to my channel. And first of all, Happy New Year. Happy 2019, everyone. Um, so I am Exorcier. As you might know already, or maybe not, I don't know, maybe this is just the first time you are here in my channel. Um, I'm normally a Sims 4 builder, and I've it's been uh, a very big while since I uploaded a video on my YouTube channel, and the reason why is basically because I am mostly on Twitch. I stream live on Twitch, building in The Sims, normally three times a week. My current schedule right now is Wednesdays, Thursdays and Saturdays. But if you are interested in about my schedule, you can probably follow me on Twitch because on my panels, on my Twitch channel, you have um, my schedule. Also, I announce every time I am live or every time I'm about to go live. I announce on Twitter and also on my Discord. I'll make sure to give you all on the description of this video all the links to my other social media um, places. Well, everywhere I am in social media. Um, and I am also on Tumblr. So basically, most of my time I spend on Twitch and on Tumblr. Normally, I don't have a lot of time to record videos for YouTube or to edit videos for YouTube. But this year, I decided that I should give it a second try because I also love to be building by myself sometimes and not being concerned about entertaining people while I am streaming or while I am building because sometimes I just need my time to look at the build, look at how it is looking like, have a look around the build, around the landscaping. Anyways, if you are a builder I'm sure you know exactly what I'm talking about. And that sound you just heard on the background, it was Shafar meowing. If you don't know who Shafar is, Shafar is my cat. I have two cats. Shafar is the female cat, the male cat, I'm sorry. Shafar is the male cat, which is a grey cat. And I also have Ariel. Ariel is a very beautiful white female cat. Uh, I share a lot of pictures on my on my Discord and I think on every of my streams everyone can see Jafar at least one time in every single single of my streams. Ariel doesn't show in all of them. But sometimes she just stopped by to ask for attention. There's no way I can make them stop. And that's exactly what happened. Jafar just realized that I was talking to the microphone and he's meowing because he just wants my attention. That's how they um, function right now. Amazing, right? Going back to the build, or actually starting talking about the build, starting to talk about the build. Um, as you can see now, the build is taking shape already. Um, this, you can see already, I think you can notice, this is a Georgian build. Well, you could tell that by the title of the, the video anyways, but this is a Georgian, Georgian style build build yes and this is actually the first time I'm building in Georgian style I didn't even knew anything 
about the Georgian style before I started building this. The reason why I decided to build a Georgian house is, well, basically because Felixander, well, let's say his name right, correctly, Felixandre is one of, not one of my favorite CC creators. Felixandre is exactly my favorite CC creator because, well, what he decides to create is basically my style all the time. I mean, it's stuff that I like because it's very, it's historical content. And also because his, all of his items are extremely detailed and well done. So I think those are maybe the best words I can say about his work. So anyways, um, for this month, uh, January, yes, January, Felix Sanza decided to, I can't say his name properly when I'm speaking English and no one can because it doesn't make sense to say it with French accent when we are speaking in uh, English. Moving on. So, talking about... What was I talking about? I've just lost myself. Oh, right. I was talking about uh, Felix and the new set. So, uh, Felix and the decided to create a set in, of Georgian windows, doors, and it also includes a wallpaper, well, a panel, and a wonderful mural that you are going to be able to see inside the build. And also, Sam, aka Hey Harry on Twitch and YouTube, and Harry CC on Tumblr, she created a set of recolors using items from cats and dogs and the same color palette as Felix Center. So she created a set that is called Heritage and it was created specifically to for us to be able to use with this Georgian set by Felix Center. Of course, you can use it in any other build that you'd like. The style is basically, is is quite Georgian, uh, but it's the style from the items from Cats and Dogs, but with different colors, actually amazing colors, because while I was doing this build, I was feeling so happy for, because I have colors that match with other items. I have wood that matches with the wall panels. I have chairs that match with the tables. I can I, Well, let's just say that everything matches. And if you know me already, every time I'm building without CC, the pain I feel is always because it's very difficult for me to build without having objects that match with each other. The main reason why I think is because the longest period that I built on The Sims was while I was building in The Sims 3. And we had the color wheel. And I still remember how long it took me to pick the colors for everything in the beginning. But then I created my own, um, let's say, custom colors inside the game itself. It was not custom content, 
but you had the option to save to save your like you could select I don't know if you used to play The Sims 3 and you know what I'm talking about but the thing is that you you were able to select the texture and then select the color of that texture so in the beginning I used to take a lot of time but then I saved my colors and textures to in my game and I was able to apply everywhere so I could have all the wood matching all the wood that I wanted to match matching if I wanted like um, a bookshelf matching with the same wood panel that I was using that was very easy to do which is not as easy in The Sims 4 and that is one of the reasons why I use custom content in the game but anyway thanks to Felix Sander, I can have amazing builds and buy items, new items with historical style and thanks to Sam I can also have a lot of in-game content but with better or at least what I think that are better swatches and in a way that they match with everything without having to do them myself. If you don't know, I also started doing CC. I have some CC available on my Tumblr and you are going to actually to be able to see to see my kitchen set that is available to download on my Tumblr. Um, you are going to be able to see on this the kitchen of this house because I used it. It's basically I did that set of kitchen recolors because I wanted to have a kitchen that was like the counters are I wanted the counters to be white and the top of the counters to be um, wood and we didn't have that not in the way I did well you are going to be able to see if you don't know yet what I'm talking about uh, sorry about the noises. Give me a second because Jafar is here again. Okay, let's see if Jafar is going to allow me to continue with this voiceover. So going back to Felix and uh, uh, I was very happy to know that I got early access to his set. Um, this this set that we are talking about so i was able to start this build before uh, the beginning of january and i also intended to release this video earlier that i'm being able to but as i had family and friends coming over for the New Year's Eve well everything mm. got a little bit more uh, difficult to manage because uh, I had to take time to be on the PC to get the builds completed and also I had to do all the editing and record a voiceover and all of this takes a lot of time and of course I didn't want to be I did part of it by, while I was having them at home, but of course I didn't want to be all the time um, doing it. But moving on. Also, I got early access to the set by Harry CC aka Sam and well, all, they, they both of them made all this uh, build be possible not only by creating the CC but also by giving me early access to it. So as you can see in the video, if you have been paying attention to the video and not only really to my voice, which I hope you have been taking it, paying attention to both, um, we you already saw me doing the exterior of the build all the landscaping oh talking about landscaping 
I had a problem with the landscaping in this build. Let me explain what happened. Well, if you are uh, one of my followers on, on Twitch, you know that this already happened to me once, but since the last patch for Get Famous, um, I had twice already the same issue with the terrain paint. So what happened with this build, and that has happened before, was that uh, for this build I decided to, to before before I move into the furnishing because I had all the content by Felix Sander but I was waiting for the recolors by Sam because she was still working on them so I decided to work on the landscape and have the landscape completely done before I move on to the interior of the build but when I was halfway then with the interior, I realized that part, well, not part, basically all my terrain painting was missing around the builds. And this is the second time that it happened to me in the game since the last patch. I don't know why this is happening. And one thing I can tell you is that the first time it happened, I had no CC in the game. I thought it was because I was using the same save file as I was using before the patch, so I started a new save file and I started building on that new save file and I never had the problem again, but this build is on a save file that I created after the new patch, but I still got the same problem. So I don't know what's going on, but if you are experiencing the same issue as I am, just remind to save the lot to your own library every time you save, because this happened when I like I was building, I saved, I exited the game, and one of those times that I came back to the game to continue the build, the terrain painting was missing. So if you save the lot to your library, and the next time after saving the game, of course, and turning off the game, when you come back, if the terrain painting is missing, you can simply go to your library and uh, put the lot back into your game with the terrain paint yes that happened to me i was very sad and bored about having to redo all the painting because i'm one of those persons that spends a lot of time painting the terrain i can give you an example right now i've been working on um, big castle on Twitch, live on Twitch, uh, is inspired by a Slovakian castle, a real castle, and one of my streams building that castle, I was, I used three hours, so I did a three hour stream, and all I did on the stream was painting the terrain around the castle and talking to my viewers and my friends and my subscribers. Um, but <laughs> by the end of the stream, by the end of those three hours, I had only one quarter of the lot completed with the terrain paint completed. Of course, we are not talking about a tiny lot, we are talking about a 64 by 64 lot. But still, I know it's a lot of time. But I enjoy every single minute of painting the terrain. We even call this lens painting. <laughs> it's an inner joke, inner joke. <clears throat> Inside joke, no, inner joke. How do you say? Hmm. I don't even remember how to say it. Mm -hmm. That's maybe because I'm Portuguese, as you uh, should know. I'm not um, English native speaker. Moving on. So the reason why I take so long when I'm painting the terrain is because I use 
I use um, a lot of layers of different different terrain paints with different opacities because I like to make the um, terrain look as natural as I can exactly exactly as my landscaping um, the plants and the flowers I always try to make everything look natural I don't know if it's because of the fact that I live uh, in Portugal and most of the places are natural grown well we also have a few gardens of course that were planted and designed before um, they were made but those are mostly those gardens inside the city inside the the cities yes those those are different and they are not like very natural looking but for my builds normally unless i'm i'm doing something like that normally i always do something that looks like a build is on the nature and not as if the nature is on the build hmm does that make sense for you guys well, it did make sense in my head, but I mean, like, the, the, the landscaping was already there, the nature was already there, and then the build was made there. And it's not like a build, and then we created a garden around the house. Well, I don't know if this makes sense now, but anyways. We are on the first floor already. Um, I've been quite distracted from the video, so I'm not quite sure if you have then all the bedrooms. Oh yes, we did. I think this is the last uh, bedroom of the build already. You, I hope you have been paying attention to all the wonderful murals that we have now by Felix Center. And again, I'm going to give all the links to Felix and the CC, Hey Harry CC, and of course to my Tumblr, my Twitter, my Twitch channel, my Discord as well, in case you want to join my Discord. Well, you can follow me everywhere. You can talk to me, you can speak to me, because I love to speak with my viewers and with everyone that likes to watch and enjoy my content being it videos or just my CC or my builds so what was I going to say right now that I just forget hmm I d oh now you can see you can see right now that yeah I think this is when I realized when I was doing the bedrooms exactly, the, the landscaping, you can see plants outside, but if you look, sometimes you can see part of the garden and you can see that the terrain paint is missing. And this was what I was talking about. Now, right now, if you are looking at outside, maybe you are going to be able to see. Anyways, I had to do it for the second time unfortunately but it took me a little bit but I think sometimes when you do something like that for a second time it ends up being better than the first well I think the build is done now I hope you guys had fun watching me building this beautiful house I did enjoy it a lot building this house so stay stay tuned for more enjoy the fly through of this build and please don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel goodbye thank you